Hi everyone, we are playing Maximum Punk Bach, which is a great name, and we're up against Grendel, and with me is Potaboys99. Hey! And he's going to help us uh, through this endeavor, and uh, we'll see where it goes from here. So do we keep this hand? This looks pretty good. This is a snap keep, yeah. Okay, yeah. The turntable is always nice. Um, Might not need it in this matchup. But it helps with the data foldings. So I think he's going to try to kill us. I have a feeling. <laughs> I don't know. You never know. Moxwell's a huge fan of this Wayland Rush business. <laughs> All right. Well, we'll see what he's doing here. All right. So we're going to career fair. What do we career fair? Liberated? Liberated, yeah. yeah. Do we just hit Liberated and play the daily cast? Yeah. Okay. Let's do and it. you hit it again. Yeah, there we go. Seems good. It's a very strong start. Oh, we should have career trade that daily cast. Uh, whatever. That's okay. We're going to use it eventually. What, what do we mill? Uh, we had a career fair and a data fold. Oh, wild side. Wild side. Yeah, wild side. Sad right, face. Well, so I think we. I've had worse here. You right? play that. Yeah, you play that. Okay. Um, all right. Would, would you mill this time? I'm going to be asking that a lot. Uh, yeah, it's okay. It's. I wish there was an easier way to. I'll just leave this open. Uh, looks like same old data sucker. All right, so I think you check R and D. Check check R and D. Government takeover, that'd be great. <laughs> Archer, fun. All right, so. So career for that data folding. And then you money off liberated. Sounds good. I don't know what he was expecting. <laughs> yeah, with, I like maybe his agenda is an issue. Oh, you also should. We should probably uh, clarify that he was your teammate for the team tournament. Then. Yeah, he was. <laughs> <laughs> so we're sort of uh, we're Jinteki sniping him and saying, uh, "Hey, come and come and play with us." Well, uh, he's he's Jinteki. I guess I don't know. Either way, someone's sniping someone. Okay, so you you get that wild side. Archives. So we just go archives Ar first. Or Ar yeah, I mean that's pretty good, I guess. Let's see what's in there, right? I mean, Three shocks. I mean, like he's the kind of guy I'll do that. There's the archers. Okay, so he must have like three fives in hand or something. Uh, he's All right, so you, so you deja vu the wild side here. Deja, deja vu wild side. Okay. Because you need that. And we can just play it. And Maybe then take else. money off liberated. Okay. Seems good. And you, you may die to see Scorch. Scorch. Does he have money for that? No. No, no he doesn't. He's just off. We could lay the I, corroder. Now. I don't know. Corroder's pretty good. In this, this could be this could be a rig shooter. Oh, that'd be pretty oh, nice. It could be. Yeah. Uh, okay, so we milled Faust Deja Vu. Uh, you you I think you try and out money him here. Okay. You play that, and then you probably lay down the turntable. We could draw first. Okay, yeah, that'd be actually probably better. You're right. Yeah, it seems good. Okay. Um, yeah, you let you. Yeah, you put that down on the turntable. Turntable. Yeah, and and then you pitch the scrubber, or the turntable. Turntable. Tur oh. We can we can get it back. We let him move stuff around. Hold on. I mean, like the scrubber. He's probably he's, he's definitely not playing assets. Those upgrades, though. Right. This right, looks right. like this definitely looks like a rig shooter. Yeah. What's yeah. in his heap again? Ooh. Okay. In his heap. A bunch of archers. <laughs> so yeah, I think it's a rig shooter. Uh, these are most likely what will the wisps or baddies or baddies fun. Okay. Will the wisps is actually pretty funny against us because they've been low when we're going to draw. Look at that. I think we go get that right. Uh yeah, we go for it. Actually, do we? Oh wait, he. You know, he might be playing with that new card that puts three counters on a face up thing. But it can't be scored that turn. Oh, you're right. <laughs> I think. Do we just leave it there then? No, we don't, because he'll get money from it. Uh, yeah, you you do it. Okay. You install and then run server one. Okay, let's do it. Obviously, I mean, obviously, his upgrades aren't like good enough for him. To oh God. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh man. Oh. That's the worst right now. I think we jack out. No, you go for it. We continue. continue. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Komainu, maybe? Uh, He's not splashing Komainu. He has 10 influence. Okay. All right, that's... Okay. Now we jack out. Uh, see, this is where Azul comes in handy, but... <laughs> so we could um, run HQ and try to trash that thing. 
but... Well, you could just slap down the data for me. Yeah, that seems better. Okay. I think it's, this could be just get, like, get money from Oaktown deck, where you just play the dedication. Now, do you play three Faust or two? Two. Okay. So that's a problem. That is a problem. Um, um, what's your what's your heap looking like? We've been to one pancakes. <laughs> I think we might actually have to deja. We might have to same old that deja vu. <laughs> I know how stupid that sounds, but I've done that before, and it's not fun. All right, you 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 probably want to gamble, and then put you just want to run all this crap. Gamble, run everything. Yeah. What do we want to hit? Let's run uh, HQ. HQ. HQ first or second? I would go first, but you know, whatever. Ooh, it probably doesn't matter. Let's see what that upgrade is. Corp troubleshooter. Goodbye. Thank you. Jackson Howard. Ooh, yes. Gotta get rid of that. You, yeah, you get rid of that. Uh, do we run it again? Um, no, you run HQ. Okay, or so ooh. ooh. Yeah, yeah, you're, yeah, you go for HQ. Yeah, it's okay. It would have been good if we installed the scrubber before we did all this. Eh, hindsight. Yeah, but then we wouldn't have been able to run both of them. True. Or we could have done it instead of gambled, which is probably right. What is well, this he, he gets in score range by advancing that once if we don't gamble. Okay, let's see what this is. Curseum grid. We don't... Do we Care bother? No. No. If, if we, it's, we could install the scrubber a couple of turns in the future. Uh, wild side and scrubber. We could install the scrubber a couple of turns in the future and then go for it. Okay. Sounds good. But yeah, so he's. Do we bin our bin our mimic yet? No, not yet. All right, that's. If we draw our mimic and our zool, uh oh. Okay. So you well, I turn tables fine. We don't care about that. Not really. I gotta say, I don't like our spot right now. We'd love to find Zoo. If we could find Zoo, we'd be in good shape. You know? That would be... That'd be fortuitous. Quality. Alright. You check, definitely check Archives, because the amount of time he's thinking, I think he binned in our gen. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, did we bin our other chronotype? Because that'd be pretty bad. Not yet. Nope. Alright, thank you. We hit God. our Mimic, though. We hit our Mimic. Oh, well, that was a while ago. Uh, let's go archives, uh, right? Yeah. Cyberdex hostel. And Cyberdex right. doesn't matter. Um, well, it, it, it's not looking pretty, but it's looking like we're going to have to pitch a whole bunch of cards at the end of our turn. I think you run R&D and then install the same old thing. So we don't want to lay down this liberated and, like, throw a same old thing down or something like that? You could do that, but you're you're sacrificing pressure. Hmm. Okay. You also put that crazy amount of HQ, which makes me think he has a lot of agendas. So maybe. Uh, Let's run RD. Let's run RD. He didn't res it last time, so we'll see what it is. is I didn't res HQ last time either. Yeah, interesting. Maybe he does know he, he he does know my deck, <laughs> so uh, you put the same one down. Okay. Pitching spooned, I think, and either. David or the Scrubber. We have two levies in hand. Oh, yeah. Okay, there we go. There's one of them. <laughs> we just got to draw our pancakes, and I think we'll be in good shape. Okay. Do you have you been both days off Um, let's see. Yep. Oh, that's a... well, unfortunate. Let's see, what we, right. let's see what we draw. Maybe we'll get Zoo. We do get or Zoo. Pancakes. Yay! <laughs> so I think we go get that, right? Yeah. Okay. Should we run R&D first? No. No? You you install, run server one, and based on what he hits... That fires. Yeah, and he knows that. That's fine. He hits the scrubber. If he hit the levy, that would have been unfortunate. Yeah. But we, we, we hit the same old thing, so... Yeah. Hades, nice. Ooh. That's now you, you'll put, probably put that on the daily cast. Okay. He may be just waiting for the maker's eye to res R&D, 
or maybe waiting for something to trash. Power shut down for one. Oof. Okay. Uh, that's, that's still up. <laughs> that's a shame. Well, we're going to levy, I think. Yeah, we're going to levy, so... We'll mill our deck. And one of those three cards is the Pancakes, right? Or yeah. did we mill it last turn? Uh, let's see. Nope, looks like we're going to get it. All right, well, no, because... We, we we draw two and then we mill we start our max ability. So we uh, couldn't mill it. Hmm. So we had two thirds chance of drawing it here. Nice. Yes. All so right. we put this down and we levy. You, no, no, no. You put it down, you take you install liberate it and take it twice. Oh, okay. Or take it once, I guess. That's yeah. Right. yeah. And then next turn you levy. Or you maker's eye. Okay, click one Maker's Eyes right here. Really? Yes, yes, just go for it. Yeah, it's like you're not going to play it any other... No, 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 not same old, not same old thing. You have it in hand. Oh, whoops. I'm glad that they let you uh, cancel that now. Yeah, they used to not, and it was a huge pain whenever you, like, SMC'd. Yeah. Oh, wow. That's like an archer or a grim or something. See, like... Jackson. Yes. You already have one in the band. Wormhole... And a Chrysium. Sad. Now you leave that. Now so now, gonna... now you levy and then hit the. Um, the or matter if, if you if you get a zoo, it, that would be perfect. No zoo. Eh. Um. Yeah. Pump liberated and uh, install the doubtful. I'm actually gonna do it twice in case because he's it puts us exactly at the same amount of credits. Yeah, that's smart. But based on what I've seen of his deck, I really don't think he's unscorched. Really. Okay. Well, you see one in the swordsman, one in the lotus field, and three Jackson. I guess you're right. And and a troubleshooter. So he's all in, all in on rig shooter, yeah. So okay, that makes sense. Okay. So now you. Uh, You'd really pain. like to hit some some breaker. Hmm. So I think you just set up this turn. I mean, it's. So what it's we could do is we could kind of run here and trash that thing, and then legwork. Get him to res. But if it does, if he reses, that's like not good for us. That's true. So I think I think we just gamble, install daily cast, install, uh, install data folding and pump liberated. Because okay. you're 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 he's not trying to score, and you're gonna draw most of your cards anyway. Right. Although that if we could just draw a mimic right now, our lives would be. Well, we need a mimic so much and and a. Uh... And uh, what do you Faust. Think? Kind of Faust. Yeah. So not great, but. What is he? What do you interns? He interns to Jackson Howard. All right. Well. Interesting. There's no way we're getting in there. So we're gonna have a ton of money. That turntable is excellent. Okay. So, um, he has a Cyberdex in the archives, though. So. Right, so we don't need daily, uh, data sucker really. No, we don't. Okay. I think I think you run HQ first click or and do what you said you would do last turn this turn. Yeah, let's get him to res this thing. Cause he just interns a Jackson Howard, and it's just like he's probably gonna dr overdraw. You think? Yeah. Yeah. All right, let's see what we hit in well, hand. That, that kind of telegraph agenda is in hand. Oh. Uh, Trash this. Yeah. Yeah. I think I think you lay down the turntable and run HQ or leg work. Because if you hit a hostile here, that'd be pretty pretty good. Still not resing. That's not definitely resing. like a grim or something. I mean, there could just not be agendas in hand. Chrisium grid. Do we trash this? Probably. Yeah, yeah, you probably do. He's gonna Jackson it back, but I think we're we're fine with that. Wormhole. Beanstalk. Nope. Okay, I don't think he's agendas in hand because. Yeah. That that kind of the no res kind of telegraph that. So what do we do here? We're really close um, on money. I think we... we uh, I don't really want to play iPad Worse because then we're trashing a bunch of stuff. Let's just gain a credit and toss the pancakes. Yeah. That seems right. I mean, normally I would play iPad Worse, but then if we draw like a couple key cards, or I think we're burning our, through our deck too fast. Right. We do have the recursion if we, if we have to go through our second levy, but... He did... Oh, he also may have milled an agenda from Power Shutdown, which he had checked. Because that one face card down is a... A gen or his power shut down. Right. We will see him put if he puts it back. Um. He's putting down power shut down, power shut down, Jackson. Oh, that's nice. 
Uh, okay. Okay, let's get some. Let's get some. No, we still need that mimic. Hmm. I mean, we have 18 cards left. I've had worsing for a mimic isn't the best. I don't think uh, it could be an agenda, but we just legged him last turn. Let's do this. Yeah, there we go. Nick Faust, run it, baby. Wait, where's my Faust? Oh, whoops. oh, you played the David instead. And I'm pretty sure. Oh, we have a click. Right. Yep. Yeah. Oh, so you can bin the iPad worse at this point. Okay. So this could be an archer. I don't think we care about that, actually. Uh, but archer plus... That's just a bastion. He's a, he's a real fan of that card. I don't know why. Uh, you said bin the iPad worse? Yeah, and the sucker. And break with sucker. All right, and we will break both, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. That's the. I think the innermost ice on our HQ and R and D are all are like program trashing things. Uh, spoon, we, yeah. We spoon. don't want spoon. Or we, we don't want spoon. Okay. We don't want spoon, and we don't want knife. This is like a situation of binning the cutlery, so we can can use them later. But we all we have the corroder in hand, so I don't really like. Atlas. Think knife. Nice. Ooh. It was an agenda. Ooh. Don't turn table at it. No, no, no. Uh, that's it. That's pretty lucky. I I can't believe it. He must have top decked it. He must have top decked the Atlas, right? <laughs> or or we just we got just unbelievably it. lucky, <laughs> and then very very lucky with the iPad worse. Yeah. Oh it's man, look at that. A, definitely a possibility. Okay, so I can, we can go for that remote again. Is the thing. It's like. So do we just throw David down and run it? No. You or do we Maker's Eye here? David and Maker's Eye? Because we could just win. You could, you could throw down Corroder. Corroder. What and are then we... run the... Oh, you know, I think this is a wormhole. He's got to have put the wormhole here. Right? What else are we... Uh, that, but he saw the be. David. He saw the David, though. So it's either Corroder or David or both. That could not be an agenda in server one. True. I'm almost tempted to just throw down David or Corroder and then run Maker's Eye. Why? Why? Okay, what's your thoughts we're at, on we're at six, throwing? We're at six. No, 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 no. I, I understand the maker's eye. Why do you want to throw it on David or Corrode or first? Um, because uh, Archer. I think he will res Archer on R and D at this point to keep us out, and I don't really want to spend six cards because that's like all but one, and then I won't be able to get through the other ice. That, that's my rationale for that. If that makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah, go for the David then. And if he just doesn't res here, we'll probably win. If we don't, we can still contest the remote. And we actually pitched our iPad worse, so maybe not. But Looks like it is know. an archer and something. Power shutdown, oh god. Project Atlas, there we there go. There we go. There we go. And a hostile, there they are. That was a good game, yeah. I mean, that was like... Not, not a very good scenario for the early game when we didn't really see our wild side or pancakes. Yep. We did have enough economy to keep us on our feet to when we did see them, which is really good. Um, yeah, that was, that was a really good game. Yeah, the swordsman placement was actually quite good. This is probably ideal swordsman placement, you know? Yeah. Uh, having a, a really hard ETR that can't, can't be suckered or parasited. We don't have parasite, but yeah. Yeah. Dang, cool, man. Uh, pretty strong, pretty strong deck. Thanks for uh, yeah. thanks for coming out and, and playing with us. Yeah, no problem. Anytime. All right, man. Uh, well, thanks for watching, everybody, and we will catch you next time.